Once you have submitted your sitemap and verified your site, there is a wealth of information that Google will provide to you and it is definitely worth checking out. In this video, we are going to discuss the search query section of Google Webmaster Tools and how to use it to your advantage. After you've logged in to your Webmaster Tools account, click on the plus sign next to your site on the web, which is located in the navigation menu on the left. Then click on Search Queries. You will notice that there are three numbers under the headings Queries, Impressions, and Clicks. Queries is a number of unique search terms in which your keywords came up in the search results. The impressions are the number of times your site has appeared in the search results for any of the given search queries. Clicks are the number of times that a user has clicked on your site in the search results. Now that we have a good understanding of what these important terms mean, let's talk about how we can use this information to our advantage. Under the query heading, you will see all of the search terms that your website has shown up for. Beside each term, you will see the number of impressions, the number of clicks, the click-through rate, which is clicks divided by impressions, and the average position in which your website shows up in the search results for that particular term. So let's say that you see that you rank highly for a particular query, in the top five for example, but your click-through rate seems relatively low for such a high ranking. This could mean that your website is not doing a good job with convincing people to click on it in the search results. You're probably wondering how your website can do a better job at convincing people to click on your website. Each page's title tag and description play a large role in search engine search results. If your title tag does not say enough about your page in a convincing manner, it will be easily overlooked. For example, if someone is searching for a hammer drill and your title tag says Acme Tools, many people will not click on your site. Instead, your title tag could read something such as quality tools you need including hammer drills, electric saws, and more. In addition, if your page description does not give the user enough information about what your page is about, the user may simply keep looking down the list. Keep these important tips in mind. Take a look at your title tags and your page descriptions and ask yourself whether or not you think they are convincing enough to make people want to click.